1,400 people, man, and yeah, and yep. counting, and they're still finding people. Yep. All right. And then, a, and then the, the flood of grace came right after. Yep. Mm -hmm. So the Lord was like, boop, but don't wait, boop. Yep. <laughs> and the Lord they had that flood like that. They had that flood, I believe, in Tennessee. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Talking about that yeah. flood? No, 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 no. But that's too. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, that, yeah. that might be the same one. Yep. Yeah. You know? Then you had a flood that hit New York. Yep. Yeah, 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 yeah. This year. <laughs> and guess what else is coming? Another flood. Hurricane Ida is coming, man. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. I've seen that. Man. Good. Uh, uh, verse 4. Then shall the wall understand that the most I spake of those uh, things. They said, then thou will un Oh, yeah, yeah. The yeah. Lord spoke this. Yeah. Right. Yeah. The Lord said that would happen. Right. That's what I think. Every time I right. see a hurricane, an earthquake, a fire, that's what I think. Right. You know, the Lord said this. this. Oh, surely the Lord is not a man that he would lie. Right. This is a uh, weather.com hurricane Ida expected to rapidly anticipate ahead of Louisiana landfall. Oh, man. Headed for the loop. Intensified, man. And didn't they have Hurricane Katrina over there too? Yep. They judged the fuck out of Jake. So, <laughs> even though, and I believe it, uh, uh, it was ordained by Esau, but through the Lord, of course, you know, because you, uh, you got a harp and shit like that. He saw his devil, but you know, right now, you know, you're gonna have that too happen again all over again. Right, because the Lord is using this uh, wicked sodomite ass to do it. Mm -hmm. You know, he blew up the levees. It was only a category, a category two, but he labeled it a category Ooh. five and blew up the levees. You got something? Yeah. So the, that it's called Ida, yep. but it's pronounced Ida. Now Ida means uh, meaning labor or work. Ooh. So that's the Lord's work. Yep. That's the work of the Lord. Yep. You know? Oh, yeah. Right. Right. I said, I will visit the earth with tempest, storms, and floods. Fact, yes, sir. Shoot. Let's get some problems. Look at a few more problems. Prophetic scriptures. Yeah, see, we don't come out here to, in the spirit of fucking uh, sicko Sakari to want to debate. Right. That shit is, that shit's quenching, man. Right. We swear past that. It says, uh, it's like, no, I, I was going to say, like, like, all they speak about is being black, black, black. We were like, don't speak about that all day, man. It's, just, it's like, it says what? The spirit of promise. Yeah, well, we're not no. black. Out of all the gifts, it says covet prophecy. Right. Okay, we have a little more water. Uh, sorry. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> sorry. Uh, I'm sorry. This is Isaiah 29 and 6. Thou shalt be visited of the Lord with thunder and with earthquakes. Right, now, what did you just say here? It says, it, it says, therefore, well, there shall be seen earthquakes and uproars of the people in the world. Right, right down there, there's uproars of the people in the world because this whole, em you know what I'm saying? The, world, the end of the world. Yep. People are uprising because of the end of the world. Yep. The world's ending. Their world is literally ending. Yep. No more stadium, no more cowboys, no more fucking Mike Tyson, no more MJs, yep. no more Kobe's. No more Frosted Flakes. Your world is ending. Right. Literally. All right, the truckers are, truckers are supposed to go on a uh, massive protest, man. Okay, you got people in uh, 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 Europe eating outside in the street, outside of the restaurants that say, if you don't got the bite or proof, you can't get in. So they're like, fuck it, we gonna all eat in the street. Yep. You see? So what's that? The uproars are ruining the economy. Yep. This shit is already in so much debt. This There's no gold Mac. Oh, not to mention we're coming up on the 20th anniversary. Ooh. All right, of, of oh, the yeah. 11th. And then the plane that was leaving Afghan had 9-11 on it. Yep. It literally had 9 11 on it. Something's you know? gonna happen, man. Lord willing. Okay? Lord willing, there's another attack. Hey, bro. Oh. Yo, pull your pants up, bro. Pull your pants up, man. That's a sign of, of rape. That's what they did to their slaves. Showing your ass been took. That's, that's some mo shit. We wanna see that. Be a man! That's what Jack doing, though. Fuck, man. A fucking grown man walking with his ass out. And we supposed to look at this? Fuck, man. man. That's why the Lord going to kill niggas, man. Uh, second Andrews 9 and verse 4. And it says, This shall the world understand that the most high spake of those things from the uh, from the days that were before thee, even from the beginning. Right, these prophecies were written way before we were born, but now we see it coming to pass, man. And niggas like that is going to die. That's right. Okay? Yeah, niggas like that is going to do the milk crate challenge and get pops. Water. Okay? The nigga was walking right here. If you know, brothers, we just we do we met the Lord putting the spirit out here now. The nigga walked right here and looked at his ass in the reflection, then walks by us. But then you niggas will go march for a stupid nigga like that dying. A dumb nigga dies and we supposed to cry? But if he was alive, he'd rob you. Oh now you can't uh make videos of prayer for them. <laughs> Jeremiah eleven. Yep, Jeremiah eleven lift up uh no voice, no make cry for yeah. these people, man. For I will not hear it. 
All right, so the Lord ain't gonna hear it. Yeah, we praying for brothers, man. So we're not praying for people like Fuck that. No. And they didn't even he didn't even receive it. Yeah, he just he looked at you like he's uh, Yeah, proud stupid nigga. The Lord gonna send some police to beat the fuck out of him. Okay. And then a stupid dumb black scab head bitch is gonna be crying and trying to call someone to. Uh, uh. We're not saying we're calling them, but if you were to square with the nigga, what are you gonna do? I used to say that in the world. First thing you're gonna do is pull up your pants. Yep. And now you left this. Now you left yep. this shit open. I said that in the world. I told us Jake. I said if I punch you in the mouth, would you pull up your pants first or, or put up your guard? And the nigga was stuck. Uh, I don't know. And then you can't run because your pants are off your ass. You gotta pull up. You niggas are dumb. Man. And they wearing fucking skinny jeans off sagging. And then niggas are wearing uh, boxers to match their outfit. So they're specifically. Sh nigga like a fucking baboon, man. Only animals walk with their ass hanging out. But you have a and, pa pack of niggas like that, me and Muggy, you ready to fight you. But then, and then get this. Uh, then you just had an Edomite cop get arrested for raping niggas. Then when they arrested him, they found more niggas raped and drugged in his phone. Wow. So you got Edomites out here ready to take dumb niggas like that, and they're going to get took. He's an offspring of a, a sagging nigga, man. Because that's what back then, they, that's how they show your buck, bro. Well, we're sagging backwards as niggas. Yeah, so that's, you, you keeping that spirit going, man. And that's another thing. Do you other fucking teachers outside of the uh, spirit of Yahweh Shai through Great Millstone, y'all ain't trying to correct Jake. You just want to, uh, come here, brother, come here, come here. You know, come on, come love. Fuck that. Rebuke him. And he says, cry aloud, spare not. Okay? We're not out here to spare these people. All right. Go ahead. Back in 2nd Edges 9 and verse 6, even so the times also of the highest. Oh, it's like I skipped the first, sorry. 2nd uh, Edges 9 and 5. For like as all that is made in the world. 2nd yeah, okay. Edges 9 and verse 2. Then shall thou understand that it is the very same time. We're in the highest, we'll begin to visit the world which right. he made. Visit, the key word is visit. Go ahead. Isaiah 29 and 6. Thou shalt be visited of the Lord of hosts with thunder. You just had the Lord strike the, the monument. Yep. And then the Lord, what's the monument? 666 feet. So that's a demon and an idol. And then the Lord struck right in front of the White House. So the Lord is telling you he's about to strike America. That's right. He's about to strike this place down, man. How, how is the hammer to earth broken to thunder? Through the Lord! He's also coming back as, as quick as lightning, man. It's gonna be a quick surgical swipe. Mm -hmm. Isaiah 29 and 6. Now shall be visit of the Lord of hosts with thunder and with earthquakes. Right, and when you go into that word visit, it means to afflict. Mm. So he's not coming back to fucking hold your hands. All right? He says, the Lord says, who, who shall I will utter and who shall not be beaten to powder? Right? And it reads, and with earthquake and great noise, with storm and tempest and flame of devouring fire. Oh, 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 yeah, oh, man. That's everything that's happening right now. That's everything. All right? With that earthquake, you always hear noise and you hear shaking, shit falling. All right? There's fires all over the world. There's floods, there's hurricanes. And then there's powerful niggas. Famous. Mad, mass death is coming, man. Oh, oh. A lot of people is going to die. Yeah. All right? A lot of people you know, a lot of people they know, yep. they're going to die. Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay? The Lord's about to end your prideful world of destruction, man. And all those that uphold Egypt shall fall with it. All these prophecies we're reading are coming to full effect, man. Revelation is speaking. Second Edges is speaking. The Bible, the Lord is speaking. You know? And that's, see... That man, the Lord so cold, he got the, the lowest of low, he brought, put us to speak. So-called niggas and spicks and minorities. When he gave the world to the white man, so if it don't come from him, it can't be true. So he tricked you. He tricked you. Then the Lord raised up, shit hit the fan, natural news, ruder. Because that's Joel, man. Yep. I'll pour out my spirit. Yep. So he's showing it even more. Yep. He's pouring out his spirit, man. You know, a lot of people are having dreams, visions, okay? Like in 2nd Exodus 9 and verse 5, for like, for like as all, uh, verse 5, for like as all that is made of the world has a beginning and an end. Mm, right, and the, every, everything has a beginning and an end. And the scripture says, better is the end of a right, thing oh, than the beginning. The beginning. So when the nuke said, we're going to be glad, man. man bro. We're going to be afraid because it says the remnant's going to be frightened. Yep. But we're going to be very joyous in our spirit. Man. It said bonus, it said bonus 
the day of judgment. I'm going to scream Yahweh Bashem Yahshai to the top right. of my lungs, man. Woo! Call Lord Yahweh Bashem Yahshai. All right, can you give Ruff 18 by yeah. the Shah? It says the Lord has avenged you on her. That's yep. right. The verse uh, 5, it says, uh, and the end is manifest. It's right, clean. it's made known. It's, 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 if you don't know that we're in the end right now, then, then you're, you're just going to die. Yeah, get a rock. Get you're from really going to get in the concentration camp. They're going to torture you. You're going to take the garage You're going to starve. Okay? You're going to get fucked up. Yep. Revelations, eh? Okay. Uh, uh, verse 6. Even so, the times also of the highest have plain beginnings. Why is plain? It's plain, man. It's very plain. But uh, you niggas make it complicated, man. Uh, you got to fucking complicate everything. Excuse uh, my French. Right. For real, though. And wonders and powerful works and endings and, and effects and signs. Okay, that's Revelations 18 and 20, and it reads. God, sorry, 18, 18 by Michelle. Michelle. Revelations 18 and 18, it says, And cried when they saw the smoke of her burning, saying, What city is like unto this great city? Right, and that's the other nations that are making money off this place, all right, because this is a consumer nation. Okay, and you see everything uh, made in China because they're making a lot of money off this place. Okay, so once the Lord's destroyed, the kings of the earth are going to cry and lament. Okay, because this is how they were made rich. You got something called the petrodollar, man. Okay, a lot of nations wax rich off America. Yep, okay, and their military force through the oil. Revelation 18 and 19, and they cast dust on their heads and cried weeping and wailing. Right, which is, which is a metaphor of them lamenting. They're going to really be hurt. <laughs> Ain't that some shit? We over, the children of God over here in America, you, you heathens are going to really be hurt from the Lord destroying the place where we were held captivity in. That's right. And, we, and, we, right. and you're supposed to just walk right in the kingdom? Fuck y'all. Yeah, man. fuck you. That's right. Fuck That's why it says in Jeremiah that uh, all our adversaries, every one, one of them is going to go into captivity. That's right. That means right. all you nations. Man. That's right. Every one of y'all. Starting over Esau, Edom. It says, saying, alas, alas, that great city wherein we were made rich. And that makes me think about you stupid fucking Saudi Arabian niggas with their little dumb hats jumping around with right. tigers and shit. Right, right, right. All you niggas, man. Right. Rich off our blood, sweat, and tears. Yeah, man. Uh, Dubai. Dubai is a very rich ass country. And satanic. And all the stupid ass whore women you worship on uh, uh, fucking Instagram. Uh, uh, Instagram yeah. They go over there and get shit on, literally. To get a bag for you niggas to come here and like every post. The Lord's about to kill the, your so-called dream girl. He gonna bring your turn your dream into a nightmare and your dream girl to death. Right. Well, according to the law, if, if a priest's daughter, which were all priests, right? Yeah. All right, under the order of Melchizedek, if a priest's daughter would, would be a whore, then you would have to burn her with fire. Okay, so all you women that's gonna be left here, you're gonna be burned with fire, man. Even America, symbolically, even more, America is a whore as a woman, it's yeah. gonna be burned with fire. Calls it a whore, right? A whore of Babylon. Yep. And it reads, Wherein we were made rich, all that had ships in the sea by reason of her costliness, for in one hour is she made desolate. One, a very short amount of time, man. All right? Two episodes of the symptoms. <laughs> okay? It's a wrap. Rejoice over her, thou heaven, and ye holy apostles. Right, so when this shit goes down, we're gonna, you're going to see the, the brothers, the men of the Lord, happy, smiling. That's, that's how the Lord's going to make a difference, okay? Because if you're in the world and your shit's popping off, you're all scared, you don't yep. know what to you're do. But well, we're going to be rejoicing, man. You know? You got a lot of Lot's wives in the so-called truth. Yep. You know, and that niggas too, you know? You don't think Elzar going to try to turn back for a punk-ass uh, fitted to cover his big-ass forehead? Yep. And he's going to run right into a circuit. <laughs> you nigga? You got niggas going back for their staff. Right. <laughs> right. I'm running back yelling, give me Acts 5. <laughs> it says that uh, uh, even the house top don't return. Right. Like how should I say that? Right. Yeah. It, uh, Rev 18 and 20, rejoice over her, thou heaven, and ye holy apostles. That's that's the elect, man. It says the kingdom of heaven is within you. That's dealing with the elect. Okay. Holy apostles and prophets. Right. We're starting with the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. All right. Who have the 100% truth, who have given us the hundred percent truth, but now we're all apostles. Yep. Because right. the word apostle means to be sent forth. Yep. Okay. Yeah, because when we were learning the hundred percent truth, we were being <clears throat> disciples. And then when we had got built up enough to be sent away, then we became apostles. Yep. You know? And it says, uh, for God 
has avenged you on her. Right, Yahweh. Yahweh by Shemi Shah had avenged you on her. How? Through our uh, nuclear fire, man. Through prophecy. Through prophecy. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So with that, we want to give all praises, honor, and glory unto Yahweh by Shem Yahushai by Shem Double honors unto our apostles and elders of Great Millstone. Shalom, Lakasayim, Wakarakim. Peace, mercy, and blessings to the elect. Shalom. Shalom. Shalom.